Yeah, this angle is not the best. <laughs> I'm open my window. Just get a bit of air in. Um, but yeah, I'm just watching my favourite YouTuber. She's only got... It's a she. She's only got 41,000 subscribers, so she's small. I need to stop saying hate. It's so negative. Mm. Just got myself a tea in a cup that begins with M. Don't know why. I posted an Instagram story today and it was just of just a little chatty post just saying how I'm taking a break from YouTube just while I get used to like just whilst I change my ideas on YouTube because I like I said if you saw the post I don't want to be doing these videos that are not me really um, and that are not and that are other people if you know what I mean because I always get like ideas I always get like, ideas from like Zoella and like I don't want to do those videos because she does them and if she does them lots of other people do it like nighttime routine or like my skincare routine like i will do my skincare routine but it will be in my own way not how she does it because usually <laughs> i just watch her videos i'm like oh my god here's an idea put the camera on edit upload like do you know what i mean i, d I just don't want to do that i'm trying to get away from that whole concept of trying to copy other people that's literally the only way to say it copying other people I mean, I'm trying to get inspiration. Her videos are so different and they're really like, they really evolve around what I want to do, if that makes sense. Um, yeah, I don't really know how to say it. I just like talking to the camera, really. I like expressing it um, to the camera, what I'm feeling and my ideas. Oh my God, my desk just broke. I'm trying to like be more with the world, if that makes sense. So try and be away from technology. I'm finding it quite hard because I'm always on video, I'm always on YouTube watching videos. I'm always listening to music, I'm always singing with the music. Um, yeah, this video is kind of like not gonna make sense, but I just kind of want to just kind of give like an update of my life and what I'm thinking right now. I'm just like, relaxed and I'm just zen if that makes sense I'm trying yeah like I was saying earlier on I'm trying this video's gonna make no sense because I keep on going off topic but I'm going to something else but I like I was saying earlier on I'm trying to be one with nature and more like I want to be more outside I want to just have some me time I want to read books I'm actually reading every night lately I'm reading a really good book about it's called Turning Pro um I've only reviewed it f like couple of chapters, I think like four chapters, five chapters maybe, um, and it's just about, I'll just say it's like about his life and how he's turning pro from an amateur to a, a pro, <laughs> um, and yeah, I actually really like reading, like, it's really, it's really comfortable, I find it very comfortable, um, and it's just something I want to do. I'm actually currently just drinking an English breakfast tea, but it has honey in it. And I might trans transition to honey instead of sugar, just because it's more, it's just better for me. Um, yeah, I might just do that. Is that noise? <laughs> you right, love? <laughs> um, what else, what else, what else? I'm doing a lot of tarot cards, tarot readings, actually. Like, at night on my own. Oh, it's a card pulling up. Um, yeah, on my night, on my own at night. Um, I love tarot cards, they're so accurate. And they just, they just make me feel like really like good about myself and they they motivate me to improve on myself, if that makes sense. What I do is I do the tarot spread and then I Google it, what each card means. I do a spread of three, so I pick three cards out of the pile with my eyes closed and then I just Google what it is on something called Biddy Tarot, which is one of the best, um, like, websites for finding out what your tarot cards mean especially at night time I always get motivated at night does anyone else get motivated at night because 
I really, really get motivated at night. Yeah, I've got work tomorrow actually, but um, on Sunday I want to go to one of my favourite spots. I walked a dog. I mean, my mum walked a dog. Um, you might have seen on my story, Instagram story, but um, we walked a dog and I like this spot and it's really, I just feel like there's good energy in that area. This area that I'm talking about. Maybe one day I'll show it. I'm not ready to show it right now. Um, I just feel like it's my safe place. Well, my bedroom is my safe place, I've got to be real, but I feel like if I was to go anywhere out of my house, it would be there. Um, I've just been really thinking about it, like, it's been at the back of my head since I've been there. I've been there a few times, I went there yesterday actually, to walk this dog with my mum. And I want to go on Sunday on my own. Yeah, I just want to go there, take some water, and hopefully it'll be a sunny day so I can soak up those rays. Um, and yeah, um... I love that place, it's so nice. <laughs> you might see it on my um, Snapchat's, oh, I don't have Snapchat, uh. um, I find Snapchat really bad energy and also I don't like Facebook. I have Facebook Messenger because I need it for work to communicate with my boss and other colleagues, we have a group chat, but um, I'm always a feather, <laughs> it's a blessing. But yeah, I just don't like much social media. I deleted Twitter, I only have Instagram actually and YouTube. I like Instagram because I like photography and I like YouTube because I love expressing my feelings and you're probably going to be like, oh my god, what's his channel, ha what's happened to his channel? But like, go, let me get you going. This is going to be my channel and if you don't like it, then you can go away. That is literally simple. And I do lots of like calming things on my channel every day in my life and like, just I, I plan to do videos that are little videos that are like not telling you what is actually happening in the video there's a video called she called it freedom and she's literally at the beach she's with her fr one friend i think and she's she's just free like there's nothing no concerns no worries um and oh my god i just want to do that it just it's so me and she was like away from people i mean she had a friend but that's her friend isn't it so she can trust her friend and she can be happy with her friend and she can be herself with her friend and i just want to like Oh my god, I'm sounding crazy about that. I just want to go somewhere. Like, I was saying, maybe go to that place that I like going to. Um, and just be free. <laughs> like I said, she doesn't have to worry anything about anything. And I don't want to have to worry about anything. And I've got my driving test. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Um, I'm just going to do some like meditation and yoga. I want to start yoga. really want to start yoga. There's actually a yoga class down where I live. And it's like five pounds for an hour and a half or something like that. And I really want to go really badly. Yeah. <laughs> I've also been really into um, crystals lately. I have like a few crystals here. So this is my setup. I'm just currently sitting. Um, I actually got this desk yesterday, um, which I really love. It's so nice. And it goes so like nice in this room. Um, I love it. Oh yeah, so I've got on, the, on my Chanel bag, I've just got some crystals that I actually love. Go away, um, energy. <laughs> Bad energy. Um, but yeah, this one's so beautiful. Look at that. Sorry, my nails are so yellow. <laughs> I don't smoke, God. Almost a month and a half now since I quit. Um, look at that. Oh my God. So that's a quartz, rose quartz. This one I have so much, so much of a connection with. Look how that shimmers. Um, I don't know what this is, I'll have to ask my mum. This is a marble one that my my friend gave me. Um, yeah, stunning. I am so sleepy. I just want to like express everything that I'm thinking about right now into one video. The book that I'm also reading is called You Can Heal Your Life and it's by Louise L. Hay. I, I don't actually remember what that book's about because I'm reading two at the moment, I've put them muddled up. Um, but I think that's a good one, obviously, because I'm carrying, still reading it. <laughs> I'm filming on my phone. I should be filming on my camera because I have it and, you know. I mean, I do film on my camera, but you know what I mean? Like, when I'm, I'm going to up, oh yeah. Also, I'm going to be uploading. I love talking to the camera. It just feel, makes me feel so good. Um, I've got two things to say. The first one is. What did I say? Oh yeah, I'm going to be. Doing a lot of videos inside my house. And don't get me wrong, I'm going to be doing loads of videos outside, obviously, because I love being outside as well. But I just feel like I can comp 
completely and utterly be myself when I'm in my house, especially in my bedroom. I mean, my house. I love my house. Um, but my bedroom. Um, when I'm out, depends where I am, but... No, like, I'm... Oh. What I'm trying to say is when I'm outside, I can't think properly because I'm distracted by something that's, that's near me um, or something I'm doing. But when I'm inside, just looking out the window and talking to a camera, I can see the nature and I can think of what I want to say and how I want to say it. And it's just really good. Also, I want to put less editing in my videos. <laughs> I feel like editing is so fake. And it is just... I just don't think it's right. Like, I just don't like it. So, obviously, there's going to be cuts and stuff for, like, things I don't want to say that I've said or if I've buggered up saying, or like, a word or I stumble on a word, then I'm going to cut that out. But not all the time, just because I want it to be as real as possible because this is my life I'm showing on a day-to-day -day basis. Not every day, but a day-to-day -day basis. And I just want it to be as real as possible because, let's be real, life is real, obviously. Um, and life is life and... I want you to kind of follow me as much in like the best possible way, in the realest possible way. Do you know what I mean? Okay, I'm just going to leave it there because it's just going to get confusing for me and for you. This is a song at the end of her video and oh my god. Anyway guys, I love you. Bye. Bye 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 bye. Bye bye.